everybody, welcome back to my channel, it's me Zoe, and yes, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, as well as sign up for fetch with my link and code down below. So in today's video, I have part two of my massive um, perfume haul from Sephora. So yeah, I have 29 different fragrances to show you with you guys. Um, just a disclaimer, these are all um, like the testing gift sets basically, where you can like test them out and then buy a big one. Um, well, one of those is you get a voucher for a bigger size, and the rest of them are just, like, sampler gift sets to, like, see which one you like the best, and so you can buy the bigger size. So, yeah, 29 of those, I'll show you guys, as well as some, um, I actually bought two fragrances from Amazon, um, two Arabian fragrances to show, and I don't want to mention, I know my lip color looks really bad, but I just put, um, if you saw my previous video, the same part one, I just put a nude color on top of <laughs> the red that I was wearing, so it's a little interesting, but it's okay. Anyways, the first one is this one. This is the Al Rahab um, slash Crown Perfumes Soft Eau de Parfum. Um, this is 35 milliliters and 1.15 fluid ounces. So this, both of these perfumes I got on recommendation from Boho Guru here on YouTube. If I, if I remember, I will link her channel down below, um, but yeah. I also will leave direct links to my Amazon storefront to buy these, which I do make a small commission from. I think that's how it works. So yeah. Anyways, um, yeah. So this one it looks like. Obviously, these are super cheap. So the lid is just like a very cheap, thin, like aluminum kind of thing. And that was what it looks like. But the bottle itself is not that bad for being under twelve dollars. So that's what that looks like. Okay. So this is Al Rahab Creme Frames Soft. Um, the notes off for Grantica are citruses, caramel, vanilla, white musk, orchid, jasmine, vetiver, and woody notes. Okay, so this is 35 ml or 1.15 fluid, fluid ounces for $11.97 with free prime shipping. So if you if you don't have Amazon Prime, I believe you have to spend $20 to get um, free shipping. So yeah, but if you have Prime, this is Prime free shipping. So very excited about this one. I have actually smelled this one and not really sure how I feel about, feel about it, yet I don't really feel like it's more like a lemon cake kind of scent, like lemon cookie. It's a little different, but we'll get into perfume reviews obviously on a different day. So yeah, that was soft. Also, very sorry if the lighting is really bright, um, but it is nice, so I need my background not to be <laughs> super blurry. Okay, anyways, next we have another Al Rahab Crown Perfumes scent. This is Dalal. So um, this has 50 ml and it's 1.65 fluid ounces. And this one was also very affordable. And again, it was a recommendation from um, Boho Guru. I've actually had my eyes on these before, but she really nailed it to me that I really want to get them. So this is Dalal. I like this I like this bottle a lot, a lot better. Again, same kind of cap. But yeah, this one smells way better, actually, in my opinion. But the notes in this one are caramel, vanilla, orange, and sandalwood. So again, the same kind of like caramel, vanilla, citrus scent, but this one's a lot better in my opinion. I think it's a sandalwood that rounds it out um, and not so sharp. Um, this is 50 mils or 1.65 fluid ounces for $11.99 with prime shipping. So again, links for these will be down below, um, as well as I'll try to link everything else that is like a set down below. So yeah. Okay, next I do want to share that I got another one of these NARS lip balms. And so I have two. Again, this is what it looks like. And I will leave a video of showing it on my lips now. Okay, so after you guys have seen that, I can put these to the side. The next sample I got is Skylar Vanilla Sky. As you saw in my previous video, I already got one of these, but I'll go over again if you didn't see that yet. So this is what the sample pack looks like. Very nice sample glass, very pretty packaging. Really like this. Notes in this one are cappuccino, pure vanilla, and caramelized cedar. So 1.7 fluid ounce, which is what that looks like, is... um. Sorry, $90 and the 10 mil is 30. So, you know, obviously way better to get the big size um, price wise per like per ounce or milliliter or whatever. But yeah, I really am happy to have this because this seems to be, people actually call this a coffee scent. So I hope it smells good. I haven't smelled it yet, but I'm waiting. So, okay, next we have this. So basically this is the Sephora Favorites Spot A Scent Travel Package. So this comes with um, seven, I think. Yeah, seven, right? 
yes, seven fragrances that you can try. And then you get a certificate to get travel size extra cost. So the fragrances are the By Rosie Jane Rosie scent of redemption size is seven milliliters, Clean Reserve Skin redemption size 10 milliliters, Commodity Milk Expressive redemption size 10 milliliters, Floral Street Arizona Bloom redemption size 10 milliliters, Juliet Has a Gun, um, not a perfume, redemption size 7.5 milliliters, Madagascar Vanilla from Nest New York perfume oil redemption size 6 milliliters, and the Flora Missing Person redemption size 9.5. So basically, um, so far without smelling them, obviously, you can probably guess my two highest ones so far are the Milk and the Madagascar Vanilla. We're gonna smell them and we're gonna go through them. Um, Right now, actually. So let me grab them all. Well, I'll grab one at a time. Okay. So the first one, this is the Floral, Floral Street Arizona Bloom. Um, it shows a little picture of it on the back. But yeah, that's what the perfume looks like. And this one, they don't actually sell as a full size. Or oh, let me get to that. Okay. So yeah, Floral Street Arizona Bloom. The notes are coconut, salt, musk, cashmere wood, fig leaf, amber oak moss, black pepper, jasmine. Um, the 1.7 ounce is $89, um, which they do sell, sorry. But the 10 mil, which is $34, they do not sell currently in Sephora. And yeah, basically, you can only get the small size um, in a mini set, basically. Like, you can get it in store, obviously, because you can redeem it, but they don't have it online. So, <sighs> yeah. Or you can get it, which we'll be going to next. You can get it in this mini set, um, but we'll get there. So, that's that one. Okay. I'm sorry. I have to reach over there to get them. Okay, the next one is the By Rosie Jane Rosie one. Um, I'm not sure how many. This is 1.2 milliliters, and I think this is a dab on or a rollerball. So that's what that looks like. So yeah, this is the By Rosie Jane Rosie. Notes of rose, nude musk, and vanilla. The 1.7 ounce is $70, and the 7.4 milliliters is $28. So... Not sure how I'm gonna feel about that one, but we'll see. Okay, next we have the Nest Madagascar Vanilla Perfume Oil. And this isn't a, like a dabber or roller one, um, just so, because it's an oil. Okay, the notes to this one are Madagascar Vanilla Bean, Vanilla Orchid and Coconut. The one ounce dropper is $98 and the six mil roller ball is $35. So we'll see about that one. I hope you like it because um, I don't really have many perfume oils. I don't know if I have any perfume oils that aren't like ones I've made, so yeah. Okay, next we have a Clean Reserve uh, Skin one. Again, you can see it looks like on the outside. That's what it looks like on the inside. So notes for that one. Uh, this is Clean Reserve Skin Reserve Blend. Notes of fresh musk, copaiba oil, and salted praline. The people before is $110 and the 10 mil is 29. So I've heard a lot of people actually like this one because it's a nice, like soft scent. Okay. Next, we have Fleur Missing Person. And very reflective on this one, but that's what it looks like on the inside. The notes on this one are Skin Musk, Bergamot, Nectar, and Blonde Wood. 1.7 ounces, $96, and the 9.5 milliliters is $26. So yeah, the perfume bottle on that is super pretty though. Okay, last two for that set. We have Commodities Milk. Um, yeah. Milk Expressive. Notes of cold milk, mahogany wood, and marshmallow. Um, I'm very anticipating this i guess because i really really want to like this because it seems so nice very pretty little bottle not glass but classic which is okay but it does come in its own cute little box okay so commodities milk expressive 3.4 is 135 and 10 mil is 20 dollars okay last one for that set this is the juliet has a gun not a perfume which i will open that's what that looks like put it back in the box. So, um, the notes for that one are Stedalox, that's the only note, which is a synthetic ambergris, um, ambergris, I guess. 3.4 ounce is 140, 1.7 ounce is 105, and the 7.5 ml is $30. So we'll see how I like that one. I know they have a dupe for this one on um, dossier called Musky Musk, I think. But yeah, whatever. Okay, next we're going to be going through the Floral Street, um, set so a few of these you can only get like in this set because they don't sell the full sizes or even the roller balls on um sephora one of them i found but it said they didn't have it so it's kind of weird but yeah there are eight cents in here so that's what it looks like and i'll take out each one as we talk about them 
Okay, so the first one is a very famous one. This is Wonderland Peony. So Wonderland Peony, okay, has notes of black currant, pink pepper, and candy floss. For all of these, this is all the same. The 1.7 ounce, 89, and the 10 mils, $34. So yeah, a lot of people love this scent, so I'm hoping I'll like it too. And then we have Electric Rhubarb. Um, the notes are rhubarb, white flowers, sea notes, salt, gardenia, frangipani, jasmine, sandbag, sandalwood, and powdery notes. And this one is not currently being sold on Sephora.com. Although I think you might be able to find them in store, I'm not sure. If you can sell this in store. Okay, next we have Neon Rose. Um, Neon Rose has notes of pear, galbanum, and citron pepper. Again, 1 by 7 is 89 and 10 mil is $34. This is Floral Streets Arizona Bloom. Again, I've already shown this one, but we'll go through it again. Um, notes of coconut, salt, musk, cashmere wood, fig, leaf, fig leaf, amber, oak musk, black pepper, jasmine. Um, and like I said, the 10 mil is not in Sephora, um, but the full size is. So I have two of those now, I guess. So if I like it, that's a good thing. This one is Wild Vanilla Orchid. So notes of vanilla flower, cassis, citruses, flowers, bamboo, jasmine, vanilla bean, sandalwood, orchid, and patchouli. And this one is not sold on the full size or in the um, travel spray at all on Sephora right now. I don't know if they're coming back or if they're just um, discounting. This is Chipri or Ch Chiper, Chipper, Chipper Sublime. I don't know. Um, it's spelled C H Y P R E. Um, notes of geranium, incense, pink pepper, damask rose, patchouli, violet, olibanum, benzoin, and labdanum. Labdanum. Um, again, this is one is not sold in the full size or the travel spray on Sephora.com right currently. Okay. Second to last, we have Floral Street Black Lotus. Notes of jasmine, saffron, and papyrus. Um, this one is sold in both sizes. The last but certainly least is one I wore today, which I'll have some thoughts on because it was interesting. This is Lang Lang Espresso. So um, they do have this one in the full size. Um, the next one are Ylang Lang Coffee Beans and Tiramisu. This one only sold in the full size. One for zero ounce for $89. Um, I wore this today. It was an interesting experience. Um, the Lang Lang and the Espresso, I don't think mixed that well, but you know, I'll have to test out more for it, more extensively. Okay. So yeah, that was the Floral Street um, set, I believe. This is like $25 or something like that. I don't know. I'm not sure. But you know, whatever. Or no. 28 And then... Actually, I think it was... I think it was more like 19 I think it was on sale, actually. <sighs> yes, I think it was on sale for 19 50 Okay. Next, we have all the, um, all the samples from that sampler set. So let's get into it. First one we have is Armani My Way, and I talked about the last one, but if you haven't seen it, I will go over it again. Notes of Orange Blossom, um, Tuberose, Vanilla, and the 5.1 refill is $120, the 3 ounce is $155, the 1.7 is $120, the 1 ounce is $90, and the 10 mil is $34. So that's what that looks like. Again, I'm very happy to have two of these because it's supposed to like bubble gum, so it smells really good. I will be very happy. Again, another Valentino Donna Born Aroma, and that's the full size looks like. The notes for that one are black currant, jasmine, graniflorum, and bourbon vanilla. 3.4 ounces is 156. 1.7 is 130. And the 1 ounce is 85. And the um, 10 mil is $30. So we'll see because I like that one. Um, again, happy to have two. Okay, so next I have the Clean Reserve Sparkling Sugar. That is what the one looks like. That's what a nice glass bottle right there. So notes for this one are... Oh my gosh, I'm on the wrong side. Okay. Let's go back here. Our black currant or cassis berries, peach necker, white musk. Again, 3.4 is 110, and the 10 mil is $20. Okay. Again, another replica coffee break. Um, which again, I am on the fence about, but that's okay. I have two to thoroughly test it. Notice this one our coffee accord, lavender, and milk mousse accord. The 3.4 ounce is 160. Um, the one ounce is 85 and the 10 mils 35. I do want to note there is a set that has coffee break as well. Or no, I don't, it wasn't coffee break. It was by the fireplace. They have that and it has like a refill bottle with it and it's way cheaper than buying them separately. So that's really good. Okay. Next we have another Libre. It's lavender, orange blossom, and musk accord. Um, the, um, 3.4 ounces is 155. 1.7 is 130. One ounce is 95. 10 mil, $30, and the value of 5 ounces is 194 for Libre. We have another Mark, Jacob, Mark Jacobs Perfect. 
notes of daffodil, almond milk, and cashmere, and the 3.3 ounce is 149, the 1.6 is 116, the 1 ounce is 90, and the 10 ml is 34 for this one. Um, another flower bomb, ruby orchid, which I'm happy about because I really like this. I think I'm really gonna like it. Um, notes of vine peach, ruby orchid, and bourbon vanilla. Kitty, stop it. Sorry, the cats. Yeah. Um, 3.4 flour ounces, 180. 1.7 is 142, and 1 ounce is 96. 10 mil is $35. Okay, only a few more left to go. We're getting to the new ones after this one. Jolone, again, um, English pear and freesia. Notes of king of lamb pear, freesia, and patchouli. Diva, no. Um, Three before ounces is 125 and one ounce is 80 dollars okay on to three ones i have not yet discussed which is good okay. here so the first one is this one it's versace's bright crystal you can see what it looks like on there the notes are actually on here which is cool um iced accord yuzu pomegranate tapini magnolia acajou lotus flower musk and vegetal amber but i wrote down yuzu lemon peony and musk 6.7 ounce 147 145 dollars the three ounce is 105 1.7 ounce is 85, the 1 ounce is 65, and the 10 mil is $30. So, yeah. Okay. Next, one of my favorites. This is uh, Love, or Killian's Love, Don't Be Shy. I'm so excited for this one. I just, I love the scent so much. Um, this is 0.05 fluid ounce, normal size. It says the scent as sweet as a Turkish delight, which I thought of um, Narnia, like the Turkish lights from Narnia. Super cute. I love this. That's what the ball looks like in a very nice thick paper card. Um, notes of this one are Orange Blossom, Vanilla Absolute, and Luscious Marshmallow. I smelled this before. The 1.7 ounce refill is $225. The normal 1.7 ounce is 275 The 7.5 mil is $50. They also have a mini refill spray set. So it has like four 7.5 mils that go in a special looking case. And so you can get one ounce for $215 basically that way. So yeah. Okay, last, but certainly least, we have Prada Candy. Now, I'm gonna have to open this one. I don't know if this one didn't come with a card, but this is what it looks like. That's Prada Candy. Um, and the notes for Prada Candy are White Musks, Benzoin, and Caramel Accord. One ounce is $76. 1.7 ounce is 115. 2.7 ounce, the biggest size, is 135, and the 10 mils, $3. So, <sighs> yeah, I think both my videos were around 17 minutes. So, thank you guys so much for watching. Um, I really enjoyed this and I'm very excited to have so, so many um, perfume samples and obviously stay tuned for like, I'll probably do collections of perfume samples, like the different brands go together because I have a few from each brand that have multiple things. So I'll do wear tests and stuff for you guys and see how I feel about these as well because I have other perfume samples. Diva, I have other perfume samples I have not yet reviewed. So thank you guys all so much for watching and I'll see you later. Bye.